Hello guys, welcome to this Windows 7 operating system tutorial. This may work on Windows Vista and we will be showing how to encrypt your own thumb drives or anything else that has a database transfer uh, system on it and runs a FAT32, FAT32 kind of file system, basically anything and this will work as 123 and take note if you have a thumb drive, plug it in. Any of you have an iPod, probably that will work or maybe not depending on Apple software but basically a USB thumb drive is what we're talking about take note that if you have uh, a lot of files in your own thumb drive it will take longer to encrypt it which I will be presenting basically just go to the same process I did and just open up computer locate it in start menu computer you should have this window open up right click on the USB which is drive F for me if you have a different kind of drive that's perfectly fine and click on turn on bit locker it depends on uh, what kind of thumb drive you have that can enable this. Um, this comes built in, pre installed with uh, built, uh, Windows 7. So, yeah, check my this box to use the password and go ahead and type in your password. Once you've typed in your password, they have an option of using a smart card to unlock the drive. We are not going to be doing that unless you want to. And just click on next. And this following uh, window shall pop up. It would ask you to save the recovery key to a file in your system or you want to print it. That is if you forget your password. Well just for search for uh, security precautions I'm going to save it into my documents by clicking on saving the recovery key to a file. Documents. And this is what it is. This is the recovery key if you forget. So I suggest for you to do this. Click on save. It should be done. It should notify you, you here. Your recovery key has been saved. Click on next and it'll start encrypting. As I said earlier, if you have a lot of files, it'll take quite longer just to encrypt it. If you have a big uh, you know, thumb drive or whatnot. So the encryption shall start and if you have a small hard drive, I mean a small thumb drive, it should take really quickly. But right now I have a bigger one. So I'll be back once this is done, depending on your, your own thumb drive size. After the encryption is complete, just go ahead and click on close. And you should have an icon a different kind of icon over your external hard drive or your USB thumb drive. So to test it out, unplug your thumb drive and plug it back in. You will be prompt with a window showing your disk, I mean uh, your, uh, what's that called? Your bit locker encryption key, so type it in. And instead of uh, always taking out your thumb drive and putting it back in and you always have to type it you can go ahead and check around that box to automatically unlock on this computer from now on I'm just gonna click on unlock after that's done it's opened C click on continue without scanning it will ask to transfer photos or whatever you want to do with it and you can just go ahead and open it up now since it's unlocked you should see the icon that it is unlocked now we've encrypted it now you're wondering how to not encrypt it anymore decrypt so to uh, do that I will post a video in the description or it's popping up after this video on how to do that so you won't have issues on how to decrypt thanks for watching goodbye